Oh, I have so much to unpack. I'll start unpacking my clothes. I'm so happy to have a place that I can finally call my own. Ooh, I can even practice basketball. <laughs> One point for me. Who could that be? I'm not expecting anyone. You? Yeah, me. Who else could it be? Were you expecting someone? What are you doing here? We're over. Read my lips. We're done. Ah, uh, come on, Yesenia. Don't be so dramatic. It was just a few fights. Every couple fights. Get out of here, Charlie. I don't want to see you. This is my house. Oh, yeah, your house, huh? Well, I see that you brought over a lot of stuff that I bought for the apartment that we share. <gasps> The coin collection? This is super valuable and it belongs to both of us. That's not true. It's mine. And get out. Get out of here before I call the police. You think you can talk to me that way? Ah, just wait and see. Ugh, leave it to that Charlie to come over here and make my life difficult. And I was so happy here with my apartment. Well, I'm not going to let him ruin this for me. I am totally done with that toxic relationship. Ugh, I'm kind of hungry. I'm going to make something to eat. Huh? The sink isn't working. Oh, no. And I can't live without water. I'm going to have to call a plumber. Hello? Yes, hi. Can you come over here and fix my pipes? My sink isn't working and I really need it. Well, I think I'll be able to put all this bad business with Charlie behind me since the plumber told me he could come over right away. I just know I'm going to be so happy here in my new apartment. Ooh, that must be the plumber. Good afternoon, ma'am. Did you call for a plumber? Yes, come in. I'll show you where the sink is. Here, the problem's in the kitchen. Of course, I'll get to fixing this right away. Mm, I better see if Charlie stole one of my coins. I wouldn't put it past him. No, they're all here. Wow. Hey, look at that. That's a pretty impressive coin collection you got there. Um, uh, yeah, yeah. Super impressive, of course, yeah. Um, excuse me one second. Could you finish fixing my sink, please? Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just, uh, I'm a coin collector myself. But yeah, don't worry. I'll get started working again right away. Uh, it's actually almost done. Oh, no. I didn't really think about how dangerous it could be to live alone. And now that guy saw my coin collection. And he didn't just see them. He loved them. I saw the twinkle in his eye. Oh no, I'm gonna have to be a lot more careful. Are you all done, sir? Yeah, 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 I'm done now. Perfect. Here's your money. Thank you. I'll head out now. Have a good day, ma'am. You too, sir. Wow. That girl had such an awesome coin collection. Oh no. First Charlie and now this guy. I don't feel like doing any more unpacking now. You know what? I'm gonna call my friend and I think she'll be a good distraction. We could go eat or something like that. Stacy, how about we go get something to eat today? Would you pick me up at my new apartment? Okay, well, I'm going to take a bath and then I'll be super relaxed and ready to eat. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's Stacy, just in time. Hey girl, thanks for coming. Oh, I just couldn't wait to see your apartment. It's so nice. Yeah, it's super comfy. But come in, come in. Come on in so you can see everything. Oh, girl, you should have called me earlier. I could have come over to help you unpack and everything. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Where exactly do you think we're going to eat? Someone got super fancy today. Uh, what are you talking about? I barely got dressed up. I, I just threw this on. Uh, no. No, 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 no. You are way too formally dressed. Okay, like, no. Take off this bow and, yeah, we'll head out like this. <gasps> You brought the coin collection with you? Charlie says they're his. Can you believe it? Ugh, no, girl. Of course they're not Charlie's. None of that, okay? These are yours. And don't give them to him for anything in the world. They're super valuable. Ugh, I'm so happy we got to check out the new restaurant that they just opened. Yeah, it's really elegant. They ordered a ham and cheese pizza. I also noticed the order said one with mushroom. Here it is. I'll bring them. Yesenia, I'm so sorry, but I'm going to have to go. I completely forgot that I have something really important to do. Here, I'm going to leave my portion of the bill, and I'll see you later. Um, 
How weird. Stacy has never acted this way whenever we go out to eat. Oh well, no matter, I guess. I'm going to order some dessert. Miss, one ice cream, please. Thank you, and can I get the check, please? Wow, it's nighttime already? There's no way I'm going to finish unpacking tonight. Oh, feels so good arriving back at your own house. <gasps> what happened? Why is everything thrown on the floor? Oh no, did someone break in? <gasps> Could this have actually happened? Oh no, what a disaster. All the cabinets are open and stuff is thrown across the floor. <gasps> the coins, the coins. <gasps> to go to the police station anyway. I'm gonna have to wait till tomorrow. I guess there's nothing really left for me to do than sleep. Oh, I just remembered that somebody robbed me last night. And now to top it all off, I have to go to the police station to file a report. I'm not going to let anything ruin my day. I'm gonna go file a report with the police to see if they can find my coin collection. Excuse me, sir. Uh, I just moved into a new apartment and I have a very valuable coin collection and somebody stole it. Oh, what bad luck, but um, that's weird. This area is pretty safe. Yes, the sad part is that I have a few suspects. Okay, tell me. Okay, so it seems that her friend, her ex-boyfriend, and plumber all could have wanted the coin collection. Yep, that's what the girl told me. Okay, well, let's go to the apartment and see if we can find any evidence. Uh, I'll bring my notes, a magnifying glass, and, ah, the camera. Help me with the camera, please. We're gonna take some photos. Right this way, detective. Officer. Okay, I'll take a few photos. Uh, these drinks. Are these yours? Or could someone else have left them? Well, I was drinking this one, but this one? I wasn't. <gasps> How rude. The thief even stopped to drink some soda. Excellent. I'll do a DNA test with this, and once we get those results, we'll find the culprit. Let's see. Friend was with her the night that the apartment was robbed, but she left the restaurant under suspicious circumstances and left her alone. So that means she did have an opportunity to break in. Well, I'll send this to the lab. And I'll go over and ask who would be willing to give me something for a DNA test. What? I'm not a thief. I am an honest man. I make my living as a plumber. No, sir, please don't be offended. It's just part of the investigation. That's it. Yeah, we're not accusing you of being the coin collection thief. It wasn't me. I'm telling you, it wasn't me, and I refuse to do this DNA test. But what I can give you is the address of the house that I was working at that exact night of the theft. Uh, Yesenia, Yesenia, are you okay? Um, yeah. Why? Because I had two police officers at my house and they were asking me to do a DNA test. Uh, yeah, I'm really sorry. I had to give them your name, Stacy. Somebody stole my coin collection. Yeah, they told me that. Ugh, girl, how could you think it was me? Look, I'm even gonna help you clean this up. How could you think that I was the one who stole those coins? I'm sorry, Stacy. It's just that night at the restaurant. You left so quickly. It was kind of suspicious. Ugh, girl, seriously? It's because I actually forgot that I had to go to my mom's house. She really needed some stuff. I had to go drop them off. Well, it wasn't the plumber because we were able to confirm his alibi that night. Yes, it's not the friend either because I was able to send in her DNA sample to the lab and it came back negative. So then the only person left is the ex-boyfriend. Uh, yeah, I already went to his house and he didn't want to give me a DNA sample. We've got to follow him. And as soon as he throws away a glass of water or anything like that, we'll grab it and we'll use it for the DNA test. Ah, my favorite food. As soon as he finishes eating, let's grab the plate. Ah, uh, doesn't the ocean look beautiful today? Yeah, we work so hard and yet we can't enjoy anything as simple as this. Thank you very much, I finished. Hey, he's not there anymore. Well, hurry, hurry, let's go get the plate. Sir, sir, we need that plate that that man was just eating off of. Oh, I'm really sorry. I already put it in the dishwasher. Ugh. 
Look, look, there he is. And he has a drink in his hand. Be ready to strike at any moment. <laughs> Now's our chance! Aha! We got it! Two days later... What? what? It's not his DNA? I can't believe it came out negative! I was sure it was him! I know! Me too! Who else could it have been then? <laughs> Those police officers are gonna keep going in circles! <laughs> I can picture it now! They're gonna be asking themselves, how is it possible that the DNA doesn't match? <laughs> I'm so smart. <laughs> that was such a good idea I had, grabbing whatever bottle I found lying around from somebody else. Ah, my coin collection. Hi friends, Snickerhoops here and welcome back to another Toca Boca gameplay. Today I'm here with a detective story, a little mystery. Well, I mean, we, the audience, know who did it, but it's still a mystery for poor Yesenia. She still has no idea who stole her coin collection. Well, friends, I have no idea how the police are gonna solve this one. And friends, it was actually Sparkly Pink's idea to do an episode where someone breaks into Yesenia's apartment. So, Snicker Squad, let me know in the comments what you think. And if you'd like me to continue the story, give this video a like and subscribe, friends, so we can finally hit the 10,000 subscriber mark. 